Hey everybody, Tails here. Today I'm going to be showing you my Game Boy, Game Boy Color, and Game Boy Advance collection so far. So, um, to start this off, I have this is my uh, Game Boy Advance. This is the non backlit version. I wanted the SP, but this is what they had, so I'll have to look for another one if if I can. But, uh, yeah. As you can see, not, not backlit. I have to shine it to a light. And uh, there's actually a game in here, Galar Defenders of Yaw Dimension, which is actually uh, kind of hard to find. Probably have to look for another copy just because the uh, label is a bit ripped, but yeah, I'll just have, I'll like, hold on to this so far. Alright, next up is this uh, GameCube link cable for the Game Boy. You basically attach it, uh, your Game Boy, uh, Game Boy Original or SP. And then you play it like this. It's mostly for like games like uh, Zelda, um, Wind Waker, and Sonic Adventure Director's Cut. It's mostly like transferring like files and stuff. I don't know too much about this, and I'm also trying to get used to it. So, yeah, don't uh, judge me. <laughs> All right, I have. Um, I'm going to show you my original Game Boy collection, the original Tetris, Tetris Blast. Kirby's Dreamland, pretty good game. Also available, it's also available on the eShop if you want to play this. Uh, Japanese version of Super Mario Land 2. Uh, Arcade Classic 2, Centipede Millipede. Terminator 2, Judgment Day. The movie was good, but the game is terrible. Donkey Kong Land 2, found this at a comic book store for like $10. Rugrats Time Travelers, Ballistic, and uh, In Your Face. Alright, uh, I'll do my Game Boy Color collection next. Oh, as I knock over a few things. Alright, I have Pokemon Crystal, Tony Ox Pro Skater. Mission Impossible, which is not really based off any of the movies or anything. Lego Alpha Team. Lego Stunt Rally, which has writing on it. I should probably get rid of that or just buy another copy. Uh, SpongeBob SquarePants, uh, Legend of the Lost Spatula. Logical. And uh, now my Game Boy Advance collection. Here's a uh, Mad Cats case. It's for a Game Boy Advance. And inside it is Pokemon Leaf Green. Alright, All right. now here's my uh, little display over here. Not an official Nintendo product, but it's just how I display the games. I'll show you what I have. Kirby, Nightmare in Dreamland, good game. Uh, Super Mario Advance 4, Mario 3. Bionicle, Lego Bionicle. Bionicle Motorin Adventures. Lego Star Wars 2, the original trilogy. And uh, Pac Man collection. Here's another one. I have uh, all three Sonic Advance games Sonic Advance 1, 2, and 3. I still need a few other Sonic games to complete the collection. And uh, yeah, it's uh, Sonic Advance uh, Sparrow Season of Ice and Season of Flame. Got this for a buck, and this for like five bucks, I don't remember. <laughs> and X-Men 2, Wolverine's Revenge. Also a good game. Now uh, I'll just move all this out of the way. And here's my GBA video collection. This is the Nickelodeon set. Uh, I have Cartoon Network and Nickelodeon. I still need a complete collection, but this is what I have so far. Uh, SpongeBob SquarePants Volume 1, Volume 3 of SpongeBob, Nicktoons Collection Volume 1, Jimmy Neutron Boy Genius, All Grown Up Volume 1, and Fairly Odd Parents Volume 2. Here's the uh, Cartoon Network. All right. Kids Next Door Volume 1. Cartoon Network Collection Volume 1, Cartoon Network Collection Volume 2, Cartoon Network Collection Limited Edition, and Cartoon Network Collection Platinum Edition, which is actually pretty rare. It goes for around like 30 bucks on eBay, so that's a, 
That's an awesome score. All right. And now um, I also have a couple other games I didn't get to show. Men in Black the series, based off the TV series. That's not really a good game, in my opinion. SpongeBob Revenge of the Falling Dutchman, just an average platformer. Backyard Skateboarding, a bootleg copy. And uh, as you can see, the I is capitalized in Nintendo. I have a Fall Apart Game Shark. Yeah, I got this from someone and like like someone that came over messed around with it and broke it, so yep. And uh finally our two boxed uh, Game Boy games. They're not really too special, but I'll show you on there. Anyway, um I have Golden Nug Casino. This was originally sealed, but I opened it up just to see what it would look like. And it's actually uh pretty cool. Just open it up. This is also brand new, so here's the game inside. There's the in instructions which you don't see often and there's also usually a poster in these as well and uh final finally chronicles of narnia the lion witch in the wardrobe which still has the poster it was used but still still has the poster there's the instruction manual another manual whatever this is and if i can yep this is the uh poster a huge poster i won't show you the whole poster but it's just some of it it's just the background for it but yeah that's uh that's my whole uh game boy advance collection and uh game boy collection so uh, that's it for this video hope you guys enjoy and i'll see you guys in the next video peace bye